Well, Tom, welcome to Hayes Lane. You're no stranger here. You played for Arsenal in pre-season, but how are you settling in and how does it feel to become a Bromley player? Yeah, I'm really excited. Um, the boys are great. I've so met everyone today. already know uh, the gaffer and uh, the goalie coach. So it's a good set up here and I'm really excited. And like I say, it was a really warm welcome this morning. And I mentioned obviously you played for Arsenal in that pre-season friendly. What was your first impression of Hayes Lane? Uh, so I've, I've played here actually a couple of times and last year on loan uh, with Welling, I played here in a friendly, not against Bromley, against uh, I think it was what, uh, Foots Clay or something like that. Um, but no, there was loads of fans, loud fans, and it was a really warm welcome. And it seems just like a very well-run club with a good fan base and a, obviously a very good footballing team. So yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to be here. We got to see a glimpse of your talent during that pre-season game. How would you describe your style of play as a goalkeeper? Uh, I'd say I've, I like to think I've got a good balance between being what you call a modern day goalkeeper, being really good with your feet and playing short all the time and as well just being an orthodox goalkeeper, keeping the ball out of the net, making big saves and throwing your body where no one else really wants to go, right? people's feet and stuff like that. So yeah. And you mentioned Andy was your coach previously. How does it feel that now he's going to be your manager for a season? Yeah, it's, it's weird. I need to start getting used to calling him Gaffer and uh, manager rather than uh, Woody that I know him as. Um, but no, it's really good. He's a great guy and we had a really good uh, working relationship and he helped me develop massively in the two or three years I had him. So I'm really excited to be uh, back working with him. We spoke to Reese Charles Cook um, recently about what it's like to be managed by a goalkeeper as well. It is quite an unfamiliar thing still, mm -hmm. but it must also help you on the coaching ground and tactically to have someone that has been there yeah. and done it as a goalkeeper. Yeah, it just it can, can get a bit lonely being a goalkeeper and everyone always looks at the goalie straight away but it's nice having him who will understand our position and understand what we're going through, the different situations. So it'll help us and at the same time he knows the level we need to be at. So it'll also push us to strive because he knows what how good we need to be at this level and in higher levels above. And you signed a contract extension with Arsenal back in May I believe. How good is it going to be for your development to, to spend a season in the National League, probably one of the com most competitive tiers of the English football pyramid? Uh, it'll be great. I've, I've done a few loans here and there and nothing nothing beats week in, week out football, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday. It's just all about uh, young goalkeepers getting games, getting experience. So it'll be great for me. And how are you settling in with the, the group of lads here, first kind of training sessions and, and being part of the kind of day-to-day -day routine? Yeah, really nice. I say we were playing some pool earlier and uh, having, having fun around lunch. Um, yeah, they're all really nice, a bunch of lads and the goalkeeping group is really good. Some of the younger ones and obviously uh, Cookie, who, uh, who you mentioned earlier, were welcoming really uh, well, so yeah, very happy. Well, that's fantastic to hear. And as we mentioned, the National League is uh, pretty relentless in terms of its schedule. Looking ahead to the bank holiday weekend, a home game here on Saturday and away on Monday. It's kind of throwing you right <laughs> in at the deep end. Yeah, it's, but you wouldn't want anything else. Like you want to get straight into it. You don't want a long way. Uh, so it'd be great just to get the games going and hopefully get some points on the table and have a good start to the season. Well, we've already had a good start, but continue the good start. Um, and uh, hopefully get six points out of the back holiday.